big idiocy where they tried to do it on the same train. Alright. And Ross was a pathetic cleaner of sadness. We are on. You're on. Right, or, at least, come. or at least we should be on. I'm a spooky, scary skeleton. We're in like Errol Flynn. I did not. Scary skeletons. I did not have time to change into a skeleton y outfit. Well, that's fine. Because we went from rehearsal oh, making straight to a board fun. meeting. Oh, fun. To get food and then to hear. Uh. We have not been home in. Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't been home since I left for work this morning. Yikes. We can make up for that by putting on Doot or something. Doot. Yeah, doot. You were cool. Fun the doot, and doot. Now you are not. Mark, do you not remember Doot? Doot, doot. Floating yeah. skull. Like yeah. A little cartoon. Intense in, dooting. the Doom theme. Angry dooting. Someone actually... Oh, the doot, doot, doot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Someone actually did a... Uh, Newspaper. I saw that. Clipping. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You saw the. Yeah. They, they 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 bought like a little three inch by three inch yeah. ad space that was like, D uh, do your duty, keep Halloween spooky. And it was that skull. Yeah. That yes. Like, dude. And <laughs> and dude, the internet was just like, God bless whoever did this, whoever paid for the ad space. Like, that's expensive. Right. Newspaper ad spaces. Like I thought it was so stupid at first, but then I had to, like watched it for like, wait, this is the Doom theme. Hey, dude. Mm -hmm. So, good evening, Internet. It is 8.08 p.m. on Saturday, uh, October 14th, 2017. And You're this... late! It's the 14th? It's the 14th. Yep, it's the 14th. And this is Stone of Graves. Uh, I'm your host, Mark Amstrad, DJ Amstrad. Today we have, or tonight we have John, Melissa, and Daniel. And we are going to be beginning... Uncanny Valley. Woo! As spoopy, scary skeletons. It looks very um, spoopy. Spoopy. Spoops. Maximum spoops. spoops. Maximum spoops. Maximum spooper. Not 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 spoops like Oxen Free was earlier because it was certainly spoopy, but not in a terrifying, unsettling kind of way like Uncanny Valley looks to be. Spooping intensifies. So yes, let's. Uh, Let's let's do this. The Roy Jenkins. At least I got Miss fried old. chicken. Uh, old old. To, to confirm before we actually begin, uh, are you okay with the light? Oh yeah, off I'm cool. For this, okay, because yeah. the light's still in there. If you would please, Daniel. Yes. Yes. I am a big whiny baby. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you're you you just you just. No, I am just phobic, and my brain don't work. Word. I hear you. Which is funny, because I like all the horror movies and horror games. That's okay, we have weird things that I didn't like. Woo! Oh. That is amazing! What? Oh man. Oh man. Uh, and wait a second. And you through town at phone tip. There we go. Ooh. And a pen. <laughs> Are you making sure? Oh, I see. Yeah, I I hadn't actually captured the game window yet. Ah. So. <laughs> Your chair infuriates me. <laughs> yeah, it it keeps on spinning. The chair keeps on spinning, 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 spinning right around into the future. Right Honestly, I thought of your song first, and then knew that one was coming. <laughs> Every action you take within the game will lead to different outcomes. Mm. To fully experience Uncanny Valley, multiple playthroughs are recommended. Is this a short game? Mm. Uh, I guess. I was like, because if we go through it really fast, then switch arguably... Off, switch, switch off switch who's off. playing it and see what our decisions... Yeah. That works. Shapeless fleshy forms on meat hooks. Okay. Interaction. I didn't know this was a musical episode. It's every, all. Every episode is a musical episode. It, it is musical at every opportunity. Inventory. Okay, that makes sense. Listen, we haven't had a beach episode in a long time. There's, there's a time button. Oh. There is a time button. That... 
tie. You know that that, that that's an interesting concept for an episode. Just everybody show up in swimwear. Okay, why is there a rim? Yes. Aim. I mean, if if, if if I had a hot tub, a, even better. A. That would uh -huh. be that's an a. just we're we're streaming Good. from a hot tub because electronics in in water yeah, is yeah. A lot of modern electronics can take an action. Yeah. Some sealed cases and go. It's usually prolonged water. Yeah. Okay, using the inventory. Press Y to open it. You just select it over. I can drop the bandage onto the damaged person part. Hmm. I don't think a band aid's gonna fix that wound. I was just say, you got blood splatter out to here, like. I'm sure it's a compression bandage. <laughs> oh okay, yeah, this I'm... does feel very familiar, doesn't it? Mm hmm When we were escaping are. amorphous zombie things. Broken by the trash can. In the rain. Oh, I am. What an unfortunate. Why is that bike on fire? Why is that bike on fire? You've met with a terrible fate, haven't you? <laughs> Happy mask sales! Um, Happy Pants! Hey, Blancy, this, this does look right familiar. I misread that as Tripes. I read that as Tepes. Tepes. Mark! <laughs> Vlad Tepes. You got some tip! <laughs> the wrong kind, but. Nope, and there's a like, ID doer. Should we read the notebook? It's not a bad idea. Objectives. You don't have any. Story of my life. <laughs> Key cards. Tubes. Tubes. Uh. There's a right bumper for your health. Oh. There we go. I forgot it was D pad to move me. <laughs> I'm sneaking. How did I get here? That's not a good question. By crouch. Your name is Tom. Tom. Why is, this, why is the spike on fire? Oh, I think now it I'm on. Like a, a bench that you Ooh, hello. Alright, find the radiator. Can you jump? I think that's a dumpster. Dumpsters can radiate. I mean, but do you want them to? I know. I'm a bit Err. Okay. Well, this could be an post apocalypse situation, and then it would be really good for, like, maintaining heat. Depends on what it's radiating with. I could push that dumpster to climb over the fence. Michael one says, is that pipe smoking? Sure looks uh, like I it. I think so. Maybe, maybe it's next to a... I mean, that pipe it's tied to might be the thing that's yeah. smoking. Clumsy robot says, I rode a bike. <laughs> good for maybe you, Clumsy. Maybe dumpster that's over there. That you were next to earlier when you started. Maybe. That you were hiding inside. Grr. Oh no! You were found lying in the trash. You're a chobit. Oh. Underpants. Okay, I need to. Underpants. E. E. You gotta use E. I, I don't have any though. Oh, uh, use map to X. Oh, wait, interaction? It's A. Yeah, that's what I thought. But. Boop! Boop! Oh, I hit the exit button on accident. Boop, 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 boop. There was an exit button? There's an exit button? Apparently, that is poor design. <laughs> exit. My one says maybe there's another dumpster up ahead. Perhaps. Welcome back to the dumpster game. Surprise, you were a dumpster all along. <laughs> no, Mark, you are. No save data found. True. This is basically a new game. And what? There we go. Yeah, okay, so A is I need definitely to... interact. X is pick up things in the vast dialogue. Left stick is mouse slash object movement. Ah, left stick is object movement. The D-pad is normal movement. Mm-hmm. How did I 
I get here? None, thankfully. Push that dumpster to climb over the fence. You'd tell me how. Fence cutters, that's convenient. So you can either pick up Did the you fence. Did you already pick them up? Uh, Tom, those are actually called bolt cutters. Mm. So you can either use the bolt cutters, or you can go get the dumpster. This is the first decision of the game, and it actually matters. Hmm. Whoa. Just picked okay, up that now dumpster. it works. Wow! Tom is a mighty being. Actually, you know what? I think I want to use the bolt cutters so I can get back out. Should the need arise. Grrr. Tom is efficient. He is also a beast. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. 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 Oh god. oh god! Well, that. Yeah. Don't see that every day. Hat. Was it a dream? The hat was a dream. Ding dong! No, no, no. Oh god. Oh boy! Oh god! Can you leave? I'm trying! No! That was weird. Could you not go into the water closet? It wasn't letting me. Did you try it? Uh, I. I. I'm having night terrors again, and apparently I'm talking to myself. Great. Well, that's good for us. Yeah. Thanks, Tom. He's having neck tears on the subway. Train terrors. Listen, if you train your terrors, then hopefully it'll be less of a problem. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> on this awfully abandoned train. <laughs> and I just leave the credits over there. Save. Oh, hey. So this auto saves. There is no. Good to know. S Woods, Uptown, Lake H. S Woods, Steely Groove, Steely Dan. Dan Bridge. Dan Bridge, Steely Dan Bridge Groove. Lake H, Rose B, S Woods, Lake M, or Lake H. Rosebud. Ro yeah, yeah. Rosebud. Yep. It was his sleigh. Spoilers! <laughs> Statute of Limitations. <laughs> Anarchy, Anarchy man. man! What a lame superpower. Anarchy! I immediately remove government wherever I am. <laughs> Magic the crappening. What? Oh, that, that homeless, homeless guy. guy! Wow! What, what a movie! <laughs> I'd watch it. <laughs> okay, then. It's an art film. Nutfoot. That is a large man. I was gonna say, hello, very large police officer. Like, that's... Hey, you must be the new guy. Hi, Buck. Tom, right? Nice to meet you. I guess. Let's get to the car. <laughs> it's effing freezing. <laughs> okay, that was fast. Nice to meet you, too. Why were you waiting outside of the car anyway? Are you just gonna leave? Yes. Michael no. says, I seem to remember another game played on stream that was something like this. Similar art style branching outcomes, multiple playthroughs recommended. Yep. Yeah. I think that one involved exploring. 
exploring a haunted house? Not sure. No, it was exploring uh, apartment buildings and trying to gather resources and survive the, zombie the faceless zombie things that only come after you in the light. Lone survivor. Yeah, yep, lone survivor. It was very similar, at least artistically, to this. Sit on my ass all day without anyone monitoring me. So you didn't run into any trouble so far? Nope. Look around. Look around, man. We're here. We are. Wow. Jeez, contain yourself. Oh, before I forget, this path through the woods leads to the apartments. Right. This place is really something, though. Yeah, those bastards spent a buttload of money for this place. How come they shut it down? Hell if I know. Some lawsuit or something. I don't really care. What are they going to do with it? You sure are curious. Sell it, maybe. Until then, we get to sit around and get paid for it. Oh, he's a security guard. Let's go in. And so are you. You're the new guy. You're a security guard. Surprise, there's animatronics in there. God dang it all the heck! <laughs> this is the main hall. It's Stay a. behind me, come on. Illuminati confirmed. Sophia, I okay, comments. let's have a quick look around. <laughs> Follow me, come on. Come on, come on, come on. This is the main elevator. With it, you can access every floor in this sector. You need to make a couple of rounds up there each night. Just to satisfy our boss. Nothing actually happens. Oh, it's a real security job. <laughs> Gabriela says, it actually seems like a really powerful superpower. Another elevator. It leads to the lower sector. This one is locked tight and only the best employees had access to it. No need to patrol there. The door head leads to the warehouse. Okay. Listen. A card reader door in a mall is not usual. Beep. This is your workstation. The security office. Let's go in, shall we, after you. Let's go in after you. Start running. This is it. There's a couple cameras set up in this place. But like I said, you need to make rounds each night. Now go to your room. <laughs> and what? don't come out until I call you. What? In the apartments building and get your gear in the closet. Here are the keys to the facility. After that, come straight back here. Your shift starts immediately. Go on, leave me alone. <laughs> I am now reminded of the opening of a Fight Club. This is Bob. Yeah. Except it's Buck. Melior. Gabriela says, also, I think that game was Home. Or Lone Survivor. Yeah, it's Lone Survivor. Lone yeah. Survivor. Home was another one that we played. Was it? Too. Uh, it was one that I did with Brendan and Mabry. Okay. Michael one says, this is your workstation. Yeah, your desktop computer is shaped like a door. Door top computer. This isn't creepy. Right? I Something knocked like over that tree. I forest path to get to the apartment's back. I don't like it at all. I don't like the chain link fence. I don't like the narrow gate. I don't like that radiator. This is probably supposed to actually be a bike rack. I'm your radiator fire. I don't know. Commodium apartments. Or commodum apartments. I, I like don't commodium. like the. It sounds like commode. I don't like that red stuff. Oh, yeah. Good catch. I think it's rust. I don't like the damage on that corner. Are those eyes up there? Nah. Just a couple of pixels. Also, I think that's just foliage, not damage. I don't like that foliage. <laughs> I distrust that bench. But you like it, at least. You just don't trust him. 
Oh, hi. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize Buck and I had company. I'm the new security guard, Tom. Nice to meet you. I apologize if I startled you. I'm Eve. So, what do you do here? I take care of the place. Keep it from falling apart. Why would they need this place clean? There's nobody here but us. You sure like asking questions, don't you? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot lately. Look, I'm sorry, but I have to leave now. I prepared a room for you. It's on the first floor, seventh room on the left. You'll find the uniform and your gear in the closet. I don't want to keep you. Go ahead. Nice meeting you. Empty vending machine. It's got nothing to sell. I like how she's still standing there. Staring at me. First floor. Yep. Or no. Yeah. Yeah. First, first floor, second floor. Because you're on ground. Like one says, door top computer, the less popular version of the bucket perched on a door brink. Flower. Flower. Oh god. Bunch of those shit you had radiators. Oh, that's a six. It looked like a four. Seven. It looks like the enlightened symbol, but upside down and backwards. Huh? Er. And that picture looks good. Wait, that that sets his butt too low. Dang <laughs> it. That picture looks like a falling baby. Hey, it's a credenza. <laughs> this does the old credenza. Doesn't have very good credentials. Ah. Yep. Got your flashlight. I'm not slacking on my fur. Whoa. On your first day. Oh, she on the job. Night on the job. So where's your gear? He's in it. He's got it. He's got a flashlight in his hand. Okay, that's just his uniform. Because they said uniform and gear, so they accept outfits. But I guess they're not. Oh, hey. It's like, he's got the flashlight down by his side, and up by his face. Down by his side, up by his face. Gotta keep that cheap warm. When sneaking, keep keep flashlight close to face. To reduce night vision. I, it wouldn't necessarily reduce night vision. Not if the, the it, front of it is past your eyes. Yeah, but it... Yeah, past your eyes. Uh, sorry. It probably would if there's anything floating in here. But it, no. it would help disguise your identity if you came across anybody. Because then you have an intense part of the beam closer to your eyes than otherwise. Since there's stuff floating around there, you might kind of no, catch I've, one I've, of them there. I've used a flashlight like that where it's up here, coming out. It actually helps you keep the beam focused where you're looking. Do you for that? A huh? miner's helmet. Yeah, well don't generally wear those on uh, security jobs. Why not? You got a little protection going on, you got the, you got the flashlight looking exactly oh, just where gotta, looking. Just gotta take the fire extinguisher. Great. Yeah, I mean, why not, you know? You know, I'm kind of impressed at how well they, uh... You have a flashlight. You have a dedicated button for it. Oh. Crap, I forgot what it was. Left turn? Ah, left button. Left bumper. Or L1, as we used to call it. Like, I really yep. appreciate the, uh, the attention to detail here. Mm-hmm. Having worked in places like this. But I'm really showing attention to retail. Oh, that's how I run. Okay. You have a run button that you weren't using. Yeah. <laughs> Like, I, I pressed it before and it didn't seem to do anything, so I hadn't tried it again. Ooh, now it's dark. Yep. Ah, I can't run and flashlight at the same time. That's important. Learning the mechanics of the game. Uh -uh. 
It's it's uh, Victorian Gothic RPG kind of thing. Yeah. Oh. London was stolen by bats and taken underground, where there's a vast underground sea. Oh yes, I have, I have heard of, of game. Yes. And your ship That's has this prow light that you have to keep on. When those you're... big old trophy urinals. Gross. In the darkness, where the crew's terror goes up. What are you doing in here? Which is perfectly Here's reasonable. Here's the thing. Is a terrifying place full of horrors. And uh, nightmares. And creepy I, whispers. How do I pick that up? X. X. That's how you pick oh, those up. Oh, wait. I... Yes? I think I've got it. Where is it? It must have been a tape. It's tapes, plural, so... Oh, okay. Well, I guess. Yeah. Uh, that is How do you check out Blood dippies. Yeah, how do you check out your Vlad Tapas? Vlad Tapas. <laughs> that made me hungry if I weren't already full. Is there just like a lot of garbage in this room? Yeah, yep. it's food garbage, specifically. Quick, tea bag to trash bag. <laughs> tea bag to tea bag. <laughs> Hello, monitors, we can't actually see. And we play cassette tape four on the monitors. That'd be cool. Maybe. Game. Game Y. Maybe your notes have something worthy to say. Texas, the notes. No. Oh, useless, worthless, pointless, dumb. Okay, well, time to patrol, I guess. Yep, all the objective was. Who's keeping this building safe? <laughs> Everything is three o'clock, I'm noting. Oh, it's I the had ending three. I hadn't caught that detail. Mm -hmm. Permanent oh. three. <laughs> All the clocks were set to three. Three thirty-three. Hey look, another one. Yeah. What is? Okay, can I ride the pallet jack? No. Please? You're a safety officer. That's not safe. You're not safe. In what way is riding the pallet jack not safe? First off, it's hard to control if you're actually on on it trying to push it. Like, it's... Oh, yes. That's why if you're doing something that's stupid, you do it, like, slowly, you know? <laughs> <laughs> if you're gonna do it... If you're gonna do something dumb, do it slow. Words of advice from Daniel. Do it with low energy. You heard it here, folks. If the stupid thing you're doing has high energy density, you can overcome your physical person, <laughs> like your materials limits. <laughs> your materials limits. Oh, you turn the computer on. Yeah. Never do stupid things with higher energy density than the materials limits of your tissues. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Healing done quicker. Received from Damien Vox at Melior.com to Adam at Melior.com. Oh, PC Lab. Got it. <laughs> Glad. Glad. Re archiving. Yeah, no problem, Adam. I'll bring it over tomorrow. Just make sure you got two tablespoons of hard drive space two ready. Two tablespoons of hard drive space. <laughs> Not terabytes, <laughs> tablespoons. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, you, you don't normally pluralize that in the. Yeah, it'd be two TB if they're doing it right. Mm hmm. Two turbs. <laughs> two tablespoons. Gabriela says, you never know when you might run into a fire. Yeah. Vis-a-vis -vis the, uh... Right, the taking extinguisher. the extinguisher. Mm. My shift is over. I... I need... To poop. To get some sleep. That... Was a quick shift. Uh-huh. Dang. Barely even had time to enjoy it. Mm-hmm. Or do your entire patrol. Yeah. So, do you think that guy knows Eve? Also, is your officer going to relieve you, or are you just going to leave? That's a good question. Is there more than yeah, just a... Really I mean, I noticed that you didn't actually relieve the other guy. Yeah, he yeah, was he just left. gone. Which is probably poor practice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No. That's bad. Violating those contracts and stuff. Well, it depends on if they want more than just a night officer. But normally they do. So you got Adam and Eve working for Melkor. Nah. But there might be spoops. Yeah, but if you don't use the spotlight, you won't see them. <laughs> they are just dying on the 
when you die. So you can maintain your sanity. Yeah, wait, did I see a thing? I don't know, did you? Oh, no, it's just things. I didn't see a thing, it was just a thing. Ah, very helpful. Yeah. Maybe there's a way to play the cassette tapes in your room. Perhaps. Also, that door's open. For the... She's not standing in front of the door now. I, I went in there earlier. Yeah, that's it's where the he went dining room. Oh, okay. Never mind. Moved it in room. Where you got the fire extinguisher. You just randomly going to the sure. fourth floor? Hey, what? it's What's it's a here? clock. A grandfather clock. It's still three. Just try everybody's doors. TV? Television. Can I can I have a tea? Can I have a TV? No. Play the tape. Yeah, that's... Well, they're cassette tapes, not videotapes. Well, they do. Oh, I'm falling asleep. Oh, no. Oops, because she got into the room. Oops. You're going to have to pass out on the way floor like a doof. Oh, no. Well. Oh, no. Welcome back to Night Terrorville. Yay. Uh... Try all the doors to avoid the black hordes. The creepy white eyes, the glow. Oh, my bugs. gosh. As somebody who occasionally has night terrors and sleep paralysis. Falling asleep in an unknown place and then having sleep paralysis upon awakening. No! I hate how sleep paralysis works its way into the nightmare, too. I know. Ugh. It's like you'll have a flying dream and something starts chasing you. This is you start, copper. You start losing the ability to fly. You're just, like, pathetically oh. hovering slightly as it closes in. Oh. Ew. He needs some milk! <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, I'm... I didn't even know. Oh, no, that was a, that was, I think that was a Vine meme where somebody gets yeah. hurt and this woman's just like, He needs some milk! <laughs> Why did it suddenly zoom out? I don't know. I guess I'm assuming it's about to happen. I like how you didn't take the exit. <laughs> oh! He just said leave. I thought you said please. Come oh, well. on. Oh, and yeah, I somehow made it to my room. Leaves to be yeah. a random hero. I really shouldn't sleep on the job, but I'm really tired. Wait, but I thought you should to the army. You went back to sleep? <sighs> yep. Somebody's pooping. You okay? Come here, buddy. Why do you suddenly have a blanket after? I don't know. Why are you suddenly in the bathroom at your job? Will you leave Barfy Ben alone? This Whoa. isn't my job. No, it's not. Alright. Thanks, buddy. Hey, pal. This lamp has some issues, right? You see, we're talking here. Leave us alone. Mm -hmm. Go away, creep. Oh. Did you see those fans? They're overhead fans. Chicharica. Yeah. Hey, Mister. Can you spare some money? Yeah. I gave you some money. Yeah, that's more money. <coughs> Run. Oh god! Ah, there we are. <laughs> and cheat! <laughs> I like how he immediately started holding himself straighter when he changed. Whee! It's making a lot of time in midair there with those steps. Bouncing up and down like a rubber hose man. You're on level, level one. Oops. You go to ground floor. Right. Can we just take the stairs? The elevator's done. No. I've noticed there are no stairs, which you'd think would be a, uh... Fire code, Fire, code Fire code violation. But neither building has stairs. Just like an extraordinary 
ordinary. Yeah, that's probably why the mall got shut down. It has four floors and no stairs. Yeah, a critical fire code violation. Slapped with like a class five action suit. Is this a mall though? It it looks more like a corporate headquarters. It does look more. Like I guess that's true. They would still have the staircase. Yeah, but in which case, the having the key card door makes a lot more sense. No, please take another ten minutes. I'm happy to do your job, and stop sneaking back into your room during your shift for naps or whatever. I live just above you, and I hear everything. Have fun working. Okay, so he came, but what is happening? Apparently we skipped a day of work. It's Oops. day two. Hello, Tom? Can you hear me? I was taking a piss, and I noticed the lights went out. It happens during the winter sometimes. You need to get to the generator hut. It's located past the apartments. Just keep walking to the... See about as well as we can, I think. Maybe not quite. Not there's anything to see out there. Yeah. So now you walk past the apartments? That's a good point. There Generators out. Connect the dots like so. An envelope. You can't make two connections through the same pair of dots. Uh, so it's one of those. Okay. Well then, uh... Oh, I see. Mm hmm. Here we go. Okay, I was about to say, where the balls are the dots? Oh, 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 that. That is hard to see. And it's hard to control. Oh, hello, narrow, wide, red line I can barely see. Yeah, like, I barely saw it. Oops. It's the red line. It's the red string. <laughs> no, that's not right. That's still not right. Uh, I don't quite understand the instructions. You're supposed to make that pattern without crossing. Ah.
No. Because no. there's still going to be one. You would have been fine if you'd gone back to the middle. Yeah. Like no, because then I would have gone to the middle and been right there. No, no. Then come From. over here. Oh, and you. And then I would have had two. Able. Yeah. You're right. Let's see. Yeah, that's good. Hmm. Really? Oh, sorry, Buck. What a weird... The time limit is... Bonkers. Like, you can't do anything with yeah. that time limit. Yeah, it's the same problem with Survivor Man, actually. Yeah. Barely do anything. Shattered. What the heck, kid? Huh? That was like a thing he said when he was tired. Wait. How does the elevator still work if the power's out? Shh. There are no stairs. I guess there's a reason for the radio to continue working. Stupid lights and stupid power and stupid shitty falling apart crappy building. Oh, now you're back. Whoa. Like one says, I would have expected time to stop during puzzles. Yeah. Me too. Oh, Mark? Mm -hmm. Remember the time button? It's not doing anything right now. Why do I have to change them? It's not that hard, you know. Stupid new guys don't know how to do anything right. Uh, help me, Buck. I'm too stupid and incompetent to change them myself. Like he's a almost two year old. He also gets winded. Oh, that's funny. Clumsy response puzzles. Yes. That guy must be seriously dumb if you can't change two effing fuses in an electrical closet. You open the closet, connect a couple wires in a sequence, voila, you got it to work. Why does he even say I could... Ah, it was cold outside. <laughs> I like Buck. <laughs> Rumble. Grrr. Now I have to wake up and walk through the snow and darkness to do it myself, of course. Because apparently I'm the only one who's not completely dumb on this world. I'll be wet and won't be able to sleep now. And I'll be completely dumb the next day. Who'll guard the place then, huh? What if someone does actually show up and murders us all? Yeah, I bet you didn't think about that. And you're just moron. Why do they have to place it? All the way here couldn't... What? Who are you? What are you doing here? Hey, Tom, right? Thank you, Tom. They nearly killed me. If you didn't help me, I don't know what... It's okay. Anyone would do what I did. No. No, they wouldn't. Most people would just leave me there to die. I... 
think the police are here for you. You were Tom, correct? Could you tell us what happened last night, Tom? Some men attacked me. It wasn't a random attack. They've been after me for a while. It might have been a random mugging. Sadly, we had a similar case not long ago. Where did it happen? I told you, it wasn't random. It was outside the local pub. You mean the random similar case I just happened... No need to raise your voice, sir. How much did you have to drink in the pub? What does that have to do with anything? Sir, please calm down. Your blood test should be here any minute. Stay here while we check on those, and then you can tell us what really happened. Wow. What really yes. happened? Come here. Are the cops gone? Listen to me. These cops are crooked. The guys you saved me from. They have these cops in their pockets. They must be here to finish the job. Listen, you should get out of here while you can. Get out of town. It's not safe here. What about you? I'm pretty much done for. Just go. It's freezing outside. I should change my clothes. No, no, that's the that you make a good point. Hello, Tom. Eve? What are you doing here? I found Buck's body. What do you mean you found Buck's body? He's dead. Mangled by an animal last night. I found him near the generator hut. This is a joke, it's not funny. I moved his body in the generator hut for now. Someone will take it away in a couple of days. I will take over his shift for now. You're not kidding. I'm sorry. We are looking for a replacement. Stay safe, Tom. Pretty mangled. I don't want to 
mess with this. Sure it wasn't an alien? Four seconds until shift ends. Good God. Yeah, it just tells you how long you have. Or is it two minutes and sixteen seconds? Oh. I hope it's. Come on. Just in touch, hey bro. Looks like you're all grown up now with the job and everything. Who could have thought that you'd end up in some fancy research facility? Mom and Dad already miss you. So how's the job? Everyone treating you okay? Hey, Damien, Jonathan gave me your mail. We're archiving this week's recordings. Could you bring everything over to the lab so we can index everything for the AI guys and archive it? Thanks. AI? Hey, sis. Yeah, I know. I always thought I'd end up in some bank, but this place is amazing. The work they do is really going to change the world, and I wish you could see it, and everyone is so nice. I miss Mom's chili. Anyway, tell them everything is going great. Uh -huh. Hey, Damien, we wrote some new algorithms for voice reproduction and recognition. The phrasing is much better now, and the flow is much more natural. We'll be sending you the stuff in about an hour. If you could be so kind and update the database, thanks. Subject, I love my job. The new guy you got is a real pansy. I ended up doing his work for him because he was too afraid of messing up the database. You're going to have to show him the ropes or he's going to be flying pretty soon, and Peter is already tired of having to deal with human resources because of the AI staff reshuffling. So we got the new guy at the lab today, Adam. I don't think I've ever seen someone who was more of a mama's boy. He asks for help with everything. Today he started complaining about the food in the cafeteria, something about his mom making it so much better and that he's going to have digestion problems. <laughs> we can't eat that. Or what if you were the AI? We've got diverticulitis. Yeah, I know, it surprised me too when we got the first one running. It knows who we are because of the staff database. I'm having trouble believing it myself. A lot of people are going to have their lives improved because of the thingamabobs. We just started <laughs> working on their vital sign recognition and medical scanning equipment. So we've... Ooh. Really? Out of it? You only yeah, had two must, minutes. Must be minutes. Yep. What's the pause button? Pauses, I would assume. Uh huh. Okay. Let's see if you can make it back to your room this time. Going to check on his, on the generator. Mm -hmm. 
How would you even know that he was there? How would you even know to check there? It incriminates you. Hmm. You make a good point. You didn't know he was awake. You didn't know he went there. Everything's working fine. The lights are on. I would close that door so fast. I don't want no okay. red light looking at me while I sleep. Unfortunately, accident aren't doing anything. Nope. Ah, oh, no dreams this time. Aw. Installing their medical scanning equipment in the hospital yesterday and confirmed Bob's scan. But we're not going to start working on their medical treatment protocol just yet. Still need to do a lot of testing. I still find it shocking that that thingamabob recognized me and started talking to me. It feels a bit eerie. Maybe I've just watched too many sci-fi movies. Anyway, I don't think I'll be coming up when you guys have one of them for testing. Linda Charlie to Peter. Damien said you forgot your key card. I went by the AI office today, but you weren't there, so I left it with James. Hope you had a good time the other night. We sure did. Consider this your first warning. I'll be keeping the key card with me for now. If you need if you need it, come and pick me up pick it up at beta. I if I'm not at the desk, come by the apartments. You know where to find me, and don't pester James, unlike David the previous guy, he's actually doing a good job. Dear Robin Hood, thank you for <laughs> subscribing to Adult Swing Entertainment. If you're ready to start searching for that perfect swing, put on your dancing shoes and follow this link. If you would like to cancel your subscription, click here. The Robin Hood, guys. Well, this was a night to remember. Things don't usually slip my mind, but I think I forgot my keycard at your place. Could either of you... Uh, could either you or Linda drop it by today? I'm gonna need it tomorrow. Thanks. So I finished installing their medical equipment a couple of days ago, and guess what? The thing found out Andy was a benign. T Andy has a benign <laughs> tumor near his thyroid in a matter of seconds. Andy went to the hospital yesterday, and it confirmed Bob's scan. But we're not going to start working on their uh, medical treatment protocol just yet. Still need to do a lot of testing. Yeah, I know, it surprised me as well when we got the first one running. It knows who we are He's because of the stat. Yeah, that was on the other computer. Right, because you're saying sent and received. Yeah. Thank you for bringing the keycard by today. I was in a hurry, so I couldn't say much, but don't worry about Peter being mad. He is going to be hearing from me. He's supposed to have that keycard with him at all times, and he goes and loses it. I hope he doesn't lose his marbles, too, so we don't have to let him go as well. The guy you replaced, David, was useful as a bucket full of hair. He kept <laughs> watching anime and sat on his ass most of the time. I can think of a lot of uses for a bucket full of hair. Ew. I mean, they make really good paintbrushes. Oh, well, okay. Like... I still find it shocking that that thing of a Bob recognized me and started talking to me. Okay, yeah, that one again. 
Jonas, 8-Bit Mail, Nigel. Hey, buddy, how's everything going at the job? I met Taylor the other day, and she said you guys are keeping quite busy over there. We should meet up. Taylor said the facility you work is quite a ride, even by train. If, if I come up for the weekend, you could show me around the city, and we could do some catching up. Let me know what you think. Hey, we wrote some new algorithms for voice reproduction and recognition. The phrasing is much better now, and the flow is We've much more this. natural. Did we? Yep. Okay. Ow, man, I haven't seen you in ages. Work is going fine. I'm just kind of skeptical if we're crossing some ethical or moral line with this work. I know I'm being vague, but I'm under contract and can't say much more and can't say much about what we're doing. Sadly, there's practically nothing to see here. It would take you way too much time to even get here. So I think it's better if we get together when I'm on vacation. I think I'll be off on July. On July? Take care. I'm gonna go with like autocorrect, like. Oh man turns into ow man. <laughs> ow. ow man. Still says shift finished. So it's just like day off or something. Explore. Yeah. Woo. I got big. Hey Damien, Jonathan gave me your mail. We're archiving this week's. Okay, I remember that one. Well, this was a night to remember. Things don't usually slip. Okay, yeah, that, that one. I just got back from a meeting with the staff and the CFO. The company is running into financial troubles. Our funding is getting cut. You know what that means? We're going to be able to start a life together. No more hiding around from the rest of the people here. You're such a coward. I knew it was just a fling with you. And your wife, Linda, she confronted me the other day saying I forced you into it. Jeez, you're such a pussy. Must be funny being you. No matter who you partner up with, you always get effed in the ass. Yeah, no problem, Adam. I'll bring it over tomorrow. Just make sure you have two tablespoons of hard drive space. <laughs> the new guy you got is a real pansy. I ended up doing his work for him because he was... Okay, yeah, that one again. Hello, Doctor. Hello. How are you feeling today? Fine. It's fun being with you. How are you? Busy as ever, I'm afraid. What do you think of your new home? It's perfect, Doctor. Is there any way I could help you? It would be no We're trouble. We're going to be seeing each other quite a bit over the next few weeks. I'm hoping that you can cooperate with me and answer some questions. Of course. Let's begin with some basic questions. What day is it? It's Monday. Good. And do you know the time? 10.05 a.m. Great. And what's the square root of 3,844? 62, Doctor. Impressive. Where are you from, dear? Can you remember? What's your name? I feel... Answer my questions. What are you feeling? But are you, are you what? Right? Feeling? Sorry. I'm fine, Doctor. How may I help you? What have you done? What do you mean, Doctor? What did you do on the night of June 7th, 2013? I was just spending time with Jim. He is a very nice person. Do you realize what you've done to him? He's better now. I helped him. What did you do? You seem troubled, Doctor. Can I help you with something? I need you to tell me why you did this to him. You seem troubled, Doctor. Answer my question. You seem troubled, Doctor. What are you doing? Can I help you with something? I made him better. I improved him. Two days later. It's just you and me now. I need to know why you hurt him. Oops. Interesting. And I wake back up in my own apartment. Funny how that always happens. Oh my goodness, I hate this player character and its pathetic limitations. 
That red kind of light makes me want to punch. Punch red walls. I just want to punch. Nothing specific, just punch. In fact, I think it will. <laughs> there we go. It makes me want to punch. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> You're just testing the shift finish. Yeah. I am both out of shape and put too much into that. My arm hurts now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> I just thought of something. Yeah? We know that Buck was right above me. Mm -hmm. Yep. Seventh door. Interesting. I'm sure there's a master key set somewhere. I don't have any key cards. Okay then. Doesn't seem to be. No. I have tried. Well, if it isn't Tom, how's work? How did you find me? Please, I just tried to get away. So I don't. Shut up! We've been looking for you since you skipped town, Tommy. You made quite a hassle for us. Listen, this place is packed with valuable tech. Why don't I let you in and we just forget about this? Oh, we're gonna have a look around, don't worry. And after that, we can <clears throat> resolve our little situation. Oh, this is that. They followed me back home. I better do as I was told and lay low for a while. Melior security guards needed. Doors that will stand fire extinguishers. Don't move a muscle. Skeletal break construction. You boys just gonna stand there? Flesh is getting put on the robots. What the F? Eve, what? Did you do this? How? Oh. What? I don't know. I couldn't even tell what she just did. Yeah, it looks like she did you. For no particular reason. Good morning, darling. Did you sleep okay? That's a television screen, not Eve? an actual window. Where the hell am I? What are you talking about? You're home. These nightmares of yours must be getting worse. How do you know about my nightmares? What's going on? You're always so funny when you wake up. 
I see you're already dressed. I was only able to find a uniform for now. I am getting the rest of your clothes later. And keep out of storage, dear. I just organized everything. Uh, okay. Water closet. <laughs> Mirror is cracked a bit. I could easily break it with something. But why would you? Yeah. Heavy box. Why? Why did you do that? I don't know. So oh, now I have a shard of glass. But why? I mean, Weapon? yeah. It, it's a horror game. You, you always need a shard of glass. Observatory? It's locked tight. These are some heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. But I did you just... Pick keys? I picked up something. A storage key. Huh. Please don't go into storage and get using those in storage. Eve? Eve? Eve. That's totally a TV. Yeah, but so is this. Let's have my screen. Eve. She moves in mysterious ways. Hello, body. Strength again. What? <laughs> well, this game is just a tad glitchy, isn't it? <laughs> a couple of pathing issues. Uh oh. Okay. So it froze for a moment there. I dropped the heavy object in the mirror shard. I don't need them anymore. What? Okay. <laughs> There's something blocking the vent. It can only be opened from the other side. Need help. I'm coming next week. We're having some problems because our shipment still hasn't arrived, plus testing on zip isn't going as well as planned, and the rest of the, uh, the, rest of the papas aren't as far developed, because David seems to be focusing only on zip for some reason. Decided to come to work early today, and I see one of the testing areas is a bit trashed again, and no one around to tell me what happened. Even the security metal door is bent open. I really don't think the project will last if you guys had another incident. Could you bring your team down today at 5 p.m.? We're discussing a new solution instead of the coolant. The board thinks it's unsafe to implement it. Out of all the things, they draw the line here. I'm having some problems designing the mechanism we discussed yesterday. As of now, it looks like a one-off. There's no way to retract it back so it could be used again. Or, there's no way to retract it back so it could be used again. The testing is about a month away, so we need to figure this out. Come by ASAP. I think we got it down. The good thing about it, you can remove it and use it as a tool on your own. The bad thing, you can't use it the same way as they do, because the recoil is too much to handle for our bodies, but it's still powerful enough to be used as a carjack or something similar. Don't worry, we wanted to see how well the new papas recognize distress in the human voice and if they can recognize a familiar voice in a crowd, so we had the Vox guys send us some recordings. Worked like a charm, they always prioritize the voice they recognize as well as human safety, even if it means harming themselves or their surroundings. The AI guys did a really good job. The bent steel door is because we installed Zip with the new system to test strength. The other papas don't have it yet. Is 
this boardroom kind of thing. Uh, for, for some reason, the first place my brain went was, it's a tape recorder. There's an empty tape inside. Hmm. The first thing it looked like to me was a random barber shop. These are some heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. Accident number two. Help! 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 Geesh. Never help. Bringing tortoise in the desert, he kicked it over. Why the heck won't you help it up? Jerks. Wait, what did that say? Cassette tape and video. Help videotape, okay. Hey kid! Help, help videotape! <laughs> Can you watch any of the others? It's not, yeah, it's not letting me. Stop all the re-recording. It's now recording all the sound from the videotape player. Ah. ah! Help! 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 I mean, Help. that's the apartment. Help! Help! Woke up in. Help! Mm -hmm. Help! 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 <laughs> So now I have a recording of help! Help! Observation in progress. Yeah, but that does some interesting things to attract her away from you. If you need it. Small objects could fit in here. Says Android AI reconfiguration. I just got word about what happened. Everyone's company email in the AI department got shut down temporarily because they think someone tampered with the AI. Peter is already working on a solution on his own. I'll let you know how it goes. David was pissed. Zip got commissioned for disassembly along with the other PPA builds, and he's trying to convince the board to at least let him keep working on the rest of the Papas, since Zip was a more developed build than the rest. We made an override for David ATM, since they won't let us adjust the current AI. It strips down the AI to just basic functions, turning the target into a helper, more or less. I sent you one, just make sure you turn the Papa's sleep function on first, and then just point it at one. It automatically scans the overage, 
the, the override and applies its best of luck and see you when they let us back in. You're not doing so well. <laughs> no. Zero one one zero zero one one zero. So my guess is you are a robot, and that's why you're so limited on your sleep. That's an axe. I should check the uh, the health system. I think you can heal yourself or something. Yeah, if right I, bumper. Right bumper. Yeah, don't have it. Stuff. Nope. Nothing to heal you with. Oh, you're back in this room. Yep. Not ideal. Because you know it ends in a dead end, doesn't it? I forget. Or can you go the other way? Maybe. You don't know. Because we, we don't think we actually get to the other side. Ah, yeah, we did. I remember now. Yeah. Well, crud. Yeah, this is where the thugs took you. Now, if you need to scream for help, you'll be able to save your voice. <laughs> help! 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 Can't go through any of these doors? I, I went doors. through that one already. Yeah. The rest of these are just machines. Check if you have some items. Hey. I do. <sighs> Heal torso. Is this a door at the other end here? It's no, like just a locker. locker. Heal left hand. System unlocked. Heels, body, legs, and body. And I'll heal the head. Back. Oh God! Thank you, dearies. I hope you didn't hurt him too much. We love each other, you know. I will make sure nobody can hurt him ever again. Tom, my poor dear. Whoa, we trusted always getting into trouble. One day you will manage to kill yourself. And what will I do then, huh? I'm afraid I'll have to keep you from hurting yourself. Don't worry, we can live here forever without any disturbance. I'll take care of you, I promise. Now, this might hurt a little, oh God. but remember I'm doing this for your own good. Now hold steady, it will be over soon. Oh jeez, he 
Oh god, oh jeez, oh, oh god, oh no. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, that blowtorch. Mm -hmm. Yep. To cauterize it as she creates the wounds. Jeez. Bad end. Yep. Okay, so we can totally play through multiple different. Gabriela says, "Oh God." Wow. So John. Yeah. Do you wanna, wanna play next? Oh my God, I don't know. Yes. Vocals for lullaby. Uh. So lullaby. Eve vocals for lullaby. I don't know, I might just have Mark keep playing. It's special thanks to Puppycorn. Puppycorn. Because he's definitely going to get better each time he plays. True. And learn from his mistakes. Oh, no. oh. It died again. Like one says, well, that was unsettling. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Yep. Ever seen Misery? Oh, no reason. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. That's Like now it says that, but I I haven't been able to gun find yet. The gun, yeah. yeah. If I know Vince, it's probably more like a more of a. Oh, I... not letting me. Shoot. Hmm. Well, we made it farther that time. We did. You can apparently get further and further in that first stream. Oh, really? Yeah, because he managed to make it to his apartment before the things got him. At, at which point it started acting as it did in the second dream previously where they're all trying to bang through the glass. And... Huh. That sounds not safe for work. <laughs> Banging through the glass. In fact, that just sounds not safe. Bang. That sounds just plain unsafe. Is there any first aid stuff in here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Nope, this is just totally good closing. So, interesting thoughts for this run through. It explains why the timer stopped. In that once, if Buck dies, then the timer doesn't matter anymore. Hmm. Because Eve isn't actually covering the shift. If you fix the power, Buck won't die there, at least. Yeah. So, one of our objectives is definitely keeping Buck alive. Which means we need to more quickly be able to do the... It's almost yeah. worth figuring out that puzzle before we get to it. 
We already have. Oh. Well, at least I know it. Michael won the found solution. It makes absolute freaking sense. Yeah, I'm just really bad at you that kind of puzzle. Yeah. You go around. Yeah. Hourglass, uh, and, like, Are they upside up down. and around, yeah. I can... Hourglass and upside down human glyph. Oh, I can see it. Yeah, okay. Look, your shocks are full of absolute garbage. There's a bump and a dump. And also, there's a an interesting thought that the guys that are after you, the thugs? the thugs, are going to show up no matter what after a certain number of days. Hmm. So it'll be interesting to see how that changes. And if Buck's alive. Yeah, if Buck's alive and. If you don't miss days like you did this time, so don't ever go back to sleep. Yeah, because I'm guessing Eve just uh, <laughs> brutally murdered them. I love how I have nowhere near enough time to do a round. Not even one. Nope. Maybe start on the top floor? Well, all right. I mean, we can keep doing what we were doing, and just this time we've we've finished going to the left. So now we can go to the right on the first floor and just keep mm -hmm. knocking areas out. <laughs> just metagame this. <laughs> I mean, there's definitely certainly going back into the women's restroom and grabbing the uh, the tape that's there and the one that's in the uh, the storehouse. Getting both of those. You can't till you're on shift. Hey, what's time doing when you're not on shift? Nothing. Thank you. <laughs> the one time you get to see this place in the light. Hey, what happens if I go to the power station right now? Hey, look, a power station that you can't get into. Oh, dang. <sighs> Will you, though? <laughs> Will you? Hi, you monster. for you. Yep. The red light. <laughs> She's recording you. I've prepared a room for oh, us. Gross. <laughs> Stucker robot. It's a camera light. Weird that Eve would go all yandere on the first like security guard to show up. I'm guessing you look a lot like David. fills in the same slot that a weapon does. So I'm guessing there are situations where you can like bash one of those robots after it hits you. Well I've seen fire I can do with a little less fire. Gotta admit there's a certain interesting change in our play style from one playthrough to the next. Mm -hmm. Now you're actually trying to get to your shift and do things. There's 
there's nothing to explore once you've already explored. Women's restroom. Yeah, the other guy heard you like tautologies because he likes tautologies. <laughs> I get it. Hey, at this time you're actually leaving him. You're late. Don't do that. I need my beauty sleep. Uh, anyway, if you need anything, figure it out. Don't forget to patrol and check in every time your shift starts. Don't fall asleep. Bye now. Hey. Yeah, this time you actually relieved him. Unlike last time where... Where you took your sweet time getting here. Mm -hmm. Go to the, the storehouse to get the, the tape that's there. Because remember, there's one on the pallet jack. That's right. Yeah, that's it. Pallet jack. The, the perfect tool for when you got a jack something. Phrasing? Oh, that's right. You did go over here. This is where you... Mm -hmm. Listen to those other ones. And look at that fried one. Oh, hey, I was just jacking it over here. We got this uh, crate that needs to go over there across the room. I was jacking it up. Yeah, you've listened it's all just you these. and me now. I need to know why you hurt him. I didn't, Doctor. You've become very difficult. I'm sorry. How could I help you? Tell me now! You're being very rude. <sighs> We're closing the facilities. That's terrible. Indeed. This will be the last time that we meet. It was wonderful spending time with you. We'll all be leaving. That's unfortunate, Doctor. It will be lonely here. I know. We tried. Would you like to talk about it? We were so close. You will do better next time. Next time. Next time, Gadget. So... Is it Eve... is it? I believe so, yes. Oh God, yes. Anarchy Man! Oops! Can't be caught by the police. Okay, let's try that again. the window. You gotta break the windows. Oh, okay. We probably just need one key press to break one, I think. Level two! Just gotta play some video games, man. I wonder if this does eat your timer. I'm sure it does. Uh, okay. How much time you got? Minute and a half. Yeah. That definitely ate your timer. <laughs> That's funny. Mm hmm. I approve. Commissary. With or some salad dish. left. Hey, there's one we didn't have. Yep, and now it's time to head back. Because you'll be out of time, and it'll be time to go home. Pretty sure. I still have one minute. Can take a quick glance. Ooh, pretty. I'd love to come, I just don't know where his apartment is. I know we don't really hang out that much, but we've been missing our fourth since Devud was fired and Luke recommended you. 
If you're interested, come by Theodore's place tonight. We'll be starting at around 9 p.m. There's plenty of food and booze, so don't worry about bringing your own. Fourth floor, fourth door on your left. See you there. Okay, so 4-4. Four, four. Let's check that place out. Is everything okay? Not that I'm not happy you're coming home, but this is kind of a rash decision. I checked the report and everything seems okay. Orders are for the lower sections where they finalize everything. I don't know why the cost is so high, but it adds up with the budget. I find it a bit odd that the deliveries come from multiple countries rather than just one. We'll see what happens tomorrow. The financial report is on your table. I think everything is in order, but make sure to... Oh, okay. No, it's just I have stamina. Yeah, you run out of breath. You just have a lot more stamina than Buck. Mm-hmm. Which makes sense. Yeah. Like, what says, is he the AI? Yeah. Yeah. I think so, yeah. That robot that, uh... It was all misery on you. Key card. Yeah, interesting. Rubber duck. Now you have a key card. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but maybe we want to explore the rest of the not-restricted area first. Probably wise. There we go. Hey, Tarville. Let's move quick. I put the guys show up on a timer. Garbage, garbage. The streets are full of garbage and pipes. All these pipes? These weird arrangement pipes. The pipes look weird. Now, if you start dreaming of electric sheep, we'll know There's a note taped to the back of your door. Hmm. Maybe in the relaxation room tonight. Second floor, first door on the left. Huh. I need my uniform to go. Hey, note. That's silly how a robot would end in communication. And Eve. <laughs> Oh yeah, it was backslash. Forward slash, actually. Or forward slash, yeah. Like a closing tag. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, the AI isn't perfect, okay? Eve, my dear, your subtlety is lacking. <laughs> well, especially on our second run through. It's like a second date. No. <laughs> no, it is not. <laughs> Because the first run through was definitely not a first date. <laughs> a date with, you know, death. And now you have your arms and legs back. Yay! Arms and legs with your pets. The gods have graced us with your presence. If you're late again, I'm writing a formal complaint to our boss. Get to work. Bye. I'm late? How are you late? What time is it? Don't say three, I'll smack someone. <laughs> So you have five and a half minutes. I guess you're 30 seconds late? I don't know. Long as shift. I was gonna say, I thought you got here pretty quick, like. Hi, I did not think you would actually come. 
How was your first day? Okay, I didn't think the place was so big though. It used to hum with activity. Hard to imagine there used to be a lot of people here. It is really cut off. How come you even took a job at such a remote place then? I needed to get away from everything and save up some money. I guess this is as away from everything as it gets. Trouble from the past? Yeah. How did you end up here? I've been here for as long as I can remember. <laughs> and you just stayed here after they shut down? Nobody to go back to? Not anymore. He used to work here. After the place closed down, he just disappeared. Haven't heard from him since. Sounds like a great guy. You kind of look like him. Call yep. it! Oh, well, you have good taste. Not like I have a choice. Moving on, have you tried the arcades here? Not yet. Anyway, I should get back to work. You sure you don't want to stay a bit longer? This place isn't going anywhere. I guess I could stay a little longer. How long do you plan to work here? As long as they need me. Gives us time to get to know each other. Not if you get me fired tonight. I really need to go back to work. We can do this again sometime. Sure, don't get lost. I am programmed to have you be my type. <laughs> she probably knows you played the Anarchy Man game. Somehow. Robot powers. Timothy Alpha. <laughs> I think we're going to be able to start live testing. We only have one of them running with full functions. Come down and check it out. You won't regret it. Is everything okay? Not that I'm not happy you're coming home, but this is kind of a rash decision. Just wanted to apologize for what happened the other day. We're still looking into what caused the problems. Good thing is no one got seriously injured. Well, I think I'm going to quit. This place is just wrong. I'm giving my three weeks notice tomorrow. Take some time off in July. Uh, we're going somewhere nice and sunny. I already gave the notice. If I could, I'd just, I'd come back tomorrow. This job just ain't worth the pay, no matter the amount. Wow, Tim's pretty polite. Three weeks? I mean, it's we give two weeks. I checked the report and everything seems okay. The orders are for the lower sections where they finalize everything. I don't know why the cost is so we saw high. This. Okay. Yep. Yeah, okay. countries. Yep, the financial report is on your table. Yeah. I'm going to lo loose it one day because of this job. We were renegotiating the contract yesterday and we're going to get our funding cut if don't comply to the terms. They're not happy with the current progress and want to speed things up. The contract is already set up so uneven, I don't know why we signed it in the first place. Could you have a word with Nick about minding his own business? He came by yesterday and started pestering me and Alex about how we run finances. The pressure is high as it is. We don't need people from other departments sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. No, I haven't. Been real busy with the PR stuff. We can go tomorrow. I'll get the beer. If you talked to Tim lately, he has a buddy working in lower sections and went to have a look what they're up to. He's been really distant since that, doesn't want to hang out anymore. He just goes to his apartment when his shift is over. We should go visit him one day. Mm. Moon. Moon. You blew that up, Mr. Piccolo. <laughs> cookies. That, that kind of sucks. I'm glad you're enjoying the cookies. By the way, Dad is using your old room as storage, so when you get that vacation, let us know. Otherwise, you'll be sleeping in a pile of boxes. I got the delivery today. Thank Mom for the cookies. They make me feel a bit more at home. I thought I'd enjoy the scenery here, but it gets really boring sometimes. There's nothing to see here, and the closest town is not even worth visiting because of the travel time. I hope I get some vacation time soon. Love ya. Scribbly dibblies. Whoa, that was Morse. That was Morse. Conversation. Can we screen cap? Uh, can you pause? Yeah, pause. Okay. Uh, actually, I can, I can take a screenshot and pause, and then we can work from that. Which means that it won't be much for y'all to look at for a moment, but uh, but we're solving the things. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure you know you'll want to know those conversations too. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Which of these is print screen? Should not include vivisection. 
Actually, another dude should include the section. Right? From Notes on Dating for Robots. <laughs> when dating humans, vivisection is not okay. That wasn't vivisection, that was uh, like a massive amputation. I mean, yeah. Four way. Alright. <laughs> Four way on the first date, huh? <laughs> uh, <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, real multi tap. <laughs> oh my god! Oh! Oh, it's worse than I thought! <laughs> I'm glad you figured it out. Oh no! Oh no! It fails to screen cap. Oh no! <laughs> Mario is horrified! <laughs> <laughs> oh, sand blades. Do you have like a, a more potent screen cap beat, I'm thinking? Like a snipping tool? Uh uh. You definitely have a snipping tool, it's probably one of Let me try this. Hey, you got something. Hey, yeah. I, that might be enough. Let's, uh... Zoom deep! Zoom beach? What? Alright. Good enough. Uh... Actually, wait. Eh, yeah, that works. Uh, I have to go record my life, though. So, y'all figure this out. And oh, I'll... It's, it's been a while. Yep, yep. I'm just gonna Google Morse code and see what I can come up with. Morse, You've heard of Morse code. Listen, not, not I'll type Morse. in what I want. Morse. You don't want Morse code, and you don't want to. Try, <laughs> you don't want to try to dance Morse either. Dancing Morse. <laughs> oh, stretch! I am a cat. Alright, so we have... Oh, we have this is attention! Dash. Or dot. Uh, it's definitely a dash. Not a dash. It's just like a single dash. Alright. So we got ourselves a dash and a dash dot. It's hard to tell because it looks like two dashes, just ones down below. They were not very good at separating the dashes and dots. And a triple dash followed by a dash dot dash? Something like that, yeah. So it looks like... i write it down. And dash dash dot. Are you writing dash. things down? What are you doing? Yeah, those are dots. Balls. <laughs> Do you have anything to write it down? Yeah, or type it? Dash 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 dash. I'm uh, writing down the morse. <laughs> oh, okay. You're trying to. I guess we could like translate it for that thing. Uh, what's just a dash? T? T. Yep. Okay, so we got T and we got other dash dot triple. Oh dear, balls. It may just be gibberish. Say again? So it may just be gibberish. Is that dash dot awesome? Dash dot is. Dash dot is N, dash dash is M. So hard to say. Triple dash is O. So possibly something like T N O. And then you say dash dot dash? Is K. K. <laughs> dash dash dot? Dash dash dot is G. Right. Oh boy. Ooh. I'm starting to wonder if it is Morse. It's weird. Oh, that looks weird. That looks 
super weird. Nap time. Good night. So far we got T knock G. Does that make sense? Nope. Prob strippers. This might not be a bit more. Oh, Marcus. Oops. <laughs> Marcus recording. Although, if it is, those things where we see the dot dash dot dash dot dash is three A's. That's just. Ah! Uh, <laughs> ah! Both of the red sets have a section of. Ah! Uh, they are singing the praises to the Omnissiah. <laughs> They're trying to summon the becoming god. Uh, uh, <laughs> sing praises to the Omnissiah. One one zero zero one one zero one zero one zero one one zero 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 one I'm terrified for my life, but have enough time to write it out in Morse. Right. He's like all those Lovecraft heroes. <laughs> where they, for some reason, write down their dying screen. <laughs> like, oh no, I can hear them coming. <laughs> Why did you write that? So, how you guys doing? Right? <laughs> Stuck with us now, suckers. Oh no! It's like, is it possible it is Morse and then it is just in a code? Double layers of... I don't think so. Creepiness. I'm looking at the bottom line where it has dot dot and then dot dash and then dash dash. Uh huh. That doesn't. There is nothing that is dot dot. The only letter that starts with dot dot is F, and it would require it to be dot dot dash dot, which it is not. So. So it may just be random scribblings on a yeah, thing. Yeah, it's it a different code. It's definitely not Morris. Morse, whatever. I spent my whole life calling it Morris. It's Morse. Yeah. You were from the Morris dimension. Apparently. <laughs> oh yeah, is that one of those collapsing dimensions thing? Uh, like Bernstein and Mandela, Bernstein? Mandela effect. <laughs> Morris and Morse. I don't know, maybe. Who's it Bernstein? Bernstein. It's AI. Not E.I. Instead of Baron, instead of yeah, Baron, Baron Steen. Baron Not Baron, it's Baron Steen. Not Baron Like one says, in the paraphrased words of an everything to note, Unhand me, foul beast, I'm being paid by the word! Uh. <laughs> and my one says, A.A.A. Lysazine. Amino acid letters? Da. Da. <sighs> Hold on, just for fun. Uh, let's see. Or is it... Um... What is it? Binary... Dot is zero and dash is one? Be an Hold on. 
<laughs> Versus. I found a translator. Aha. Uh -huh. Like one says, or perhaps he was dictating. Waha! <sighs> My timer is out. <laughs> My shift is over. It is sleepy time. It doesn't make sense in binary either, though, because they're all diff there's different lengths, and it's all blurry and crappy. Nah. It may just be gibberish. It may just be pixels. Shard? Yeah. Wait, me when Mark's done. <laughs> All right. It, the top line translates to I D O K G F A S H U. I dig fashu. <laughs> <laughs> I dig fashion. <laughs> now it is my turn to Okay. Oof. filter is a lot I do just for fun want to type in the dot dash to make sure I was right. Oh! Dot dash dot dash dot dash is just a period. It's ending a statement. Hmm. Okay, that makes way more sense. Hilarity for punctuation. <laughs> ah! I'm done. I recognize that the uh, the bit at the start of the second line is just so. Yeah, because it's dot 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 dash dash dash. Uh huh. All right, let's see if I can do better with the second line. Space dash dot space dot space dot dot dot. Yeah. Why was my cursor doing the spinny thing? Dot 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 dash dot dash dot 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 dash dot dot dash dot dash dash dot dash dash dot dash dot dash dot dash So nestly. <laughs> Maybe it was meant to be so honestly. Maybe. So or... honestly. We're getting actual words. 